Hey everybody. Today I'm going to discuss some things about Wikipedia. We can pretty much call this a rant video about them. Today I'm going to talk about some things that Wikipedia does not want you to know. So Wikipedia is that so-called free encyclopedia out there that anybody can edit. Or at least you think when you see that on the site. But anyways, when you search something on Google about almost anything, more than likely you'll find a page about it on Wikipedia. Today we're going to be talking about Magic Jack in particular. See, Magic Jack is the free, well, the 1995 a year device that gets your free local long distance calling to anywhere in the United States and Canada. And you have a little, little device that plugs into your computer and you, you buy it almost at any retail store for about 40 bucks. And Wikipedia, of course, has an article about Magic Jack. And this article has some information that was quite outdated. Some information had to do with no reporting, that sort of stuff. So I figured since anybody can edit Wikipedia, I'd go in and I'd update the information. See, I'm highly familiar with how the Magic Jack works. I have one myself. I've done lots and lots of research on the internet about it. And I never figured Wikipedia would give me so much trouble about updating the article. A few things I posted in were about the number reporting feature. Originally, the site stated that as of December 2010, you cannot transfer your existing phone number to the service. But even even though recently, back in May or so, they're now allowing some users to port their existing phone numbers to the service. That's one thing I try to update. Even try sourcing it and all that stuff. They take it down. They they undo it. Then they try to say we need that you have to have so-called pert like really good sources to back this information up, as if it's you know like a school project. But let me let me tell you some information about that. I'm a full-time college student, and I just took argument-based research. Wikipedia gives you 100 times more trouble to edit their information than to write an essay for an argument argument course in college. But like I say, I mean it's ridiculous. So Wikipedia more or less said this rather had their information remain outdated and irrelevant. So if you're looking for up-to-date information, don't use Wikipedia. I mean, colleges and institutions don't allow Wikipedia as a source for a reason. Now on to some more information. Okay, now we're looking at the Wikipedia article on Magic Jack. And while I'm at it, I'm going to pull up a notepad window with the information that I edited. Okay, first off, on this main section of the article, this section here, in this area, I had some information about Magic Jack phone numbers. For instance, I said that they are unlisted and you cannot list them, which is a true thing. It states on the Magic Jack website. And down here in criticisms, I updated this as well. Right now it says as of December 5th, 2010, users are not able to keep their existing phone number of changing the Magic Jack. This is outdated information. So, anyways, let's look at the edits that I've done. Okay. Here are the edits I put into the article. First here. As of June 2011, new users to Magic Jack who wish to keep their Existing phone number have the option to place a transfer request for their phone number in the Magic Jack account page. Let's scroll down a little bit. We'll see the next edit. And that is in the criticisms area. It says here before summer 2011, users were not able to keep their existing phone number if switching to Magic Jack. As of June 25, 2011, Magic Jack is now able to transfer some existing phone numbers to the service for a nominal fee, which is all true information from MagicJack.com. And of course, this information got taken down. Okay, now I'm looking at the Wikipedia article again. And this video clip is being made pretty much a month later the previous video clips 
were made on June 26, 2011. In this video clip, along with the last one I made of the Notepad article, is being made on July 25, 2011. And you might be able to notice they took out everything that I added in. And nobody else apparently has been successfully able to upgrade, update the article. So this article still has information that is highly outdated. Oh, it gets better. Let's go have a look at my email account. I want to show you guys something else. Okay, have a look here at what Cliff C has to say about me. Okay. It says, please do not add or change content without verifying it by citing reliable sources. Well, how much reliable can you get than the manufacturer's website? Such as managerjack.com. It says you must discuss everything on the article's talk page. Well, it, it gets better. Scroll down a little bit. Now he has to say something about my username. It says everyone is welcome to con contribute constructively to the encyclopedia. However, the username you have chosen seems to imply that you are editing on behalf of a group, company, or a website. Let's see something else here. It says there are two issues with this. It is possible that you have a conflict of interest in keeping with Wikipedia's neutral point of view policy. You must exercise great caution when editing on topics related to your organization. Well, we could. Wikipedia, Magic Jack is not my organization at all. I'm just a highly experienced user, and I was willing to upgrade your talk, your article, so that way everybody else likes to see updated information. It says your account cannot re represent a group of people, which I'm not a group of people. You may wish to create a new account with a username that represents only you. Alternatively, you may consider changing your username to avoid giving the impression that your personal account is being used for spam. Can you believe this, everybody? I mean, this is this is Wikipedia. This is this is how they treat you. It says regardless of whether you change your name or create a new account, you are not exempted from the guidelines concerning editing where you have a conflict of interest. For information on how to contribute to Wikipedia when you have a conflict of interest, please see. FAQ for our frequently asked questions for, for organizations. Thank you. I mean, this is ridiculous. I mean, they're they're saying that my username is stating that I'm some sort of big corporate or organization. Okay, for anybody who watched this video, possibly included Cliff C from Wikipedia. You know what Q Comp MTDX stands for? How about trying this? Cube Computer Mid Tower Deluxe. It's a lineup of custom built computers that I build. Such as that one there. Now, is that really a big organization to you? Seriously? I'm not an authorized Magic Jack reseller. I don't work for Magic Jack LP. I'm just a Magic Jack user who's highly experienced with the product. And I want to share some information about it. All the information that I posted to the Magic Jack Wikipedia article was information from the Magic Jack webpage, from the frequently asked question page. So go ahead and try to say that this um, information is inadequate for your page. Go ahead and try. I mean, you just rather have false information? That's your choice. I'll just let everybody know that your site has inadequate information. I mean, no one at colleges and institutions say that Wikipedia is not a relevant source for information.